GH spoilers reveal that John has been shot. And although it's unclear whether he is still alive or not, the police are swiftly moving in to investigate this dangerous incident. The shooting has sent shockwaves through the community, and with a prominent figure like John involved, the authorities are fully committed to uncovering every detail of the case. They have begun gathering evidence, taking statements from witnesses at the scene, and searching for any clues that could shed light on the events leading up to the shooting. As the investigation unfolds, not only will John's secrets but also those of the people around him be brought to light, revealing potential motives that could lead to serious consequences. This could be one of the most dangerous cases the police have ever faced, and they are preparing for the complex developments that might arise in the near future. Chase has discovered that Christina is the prime suspect in John's shooting, which has escalated the situation to unprecedented levels of tension. As evidence begins to point towards Christina, the authorities have no choice but to proceed with her arrest. This decision has been confirmed, and the impending arrest is likely to cause a major upheaval within the community, especially within the Corinthos family. All eyes are now on Christina, and the unfolding events could dramatically alter the course of the investigation. Questions surrounding the motives and circumstances leading to the shooting will soon be revealed as Chase and the investigative team work tirelessly to uncover the truth behind this dangerous situation. Alexis has decided to confess to killing John, even though she did not actually commit the crime. In a moment of extreme difficulty and tension, Alexis understands that her daughter, Christina, is the main suspect in the case. Driven by love and maternal instinct, she knows that allowing Christina to face the full force of the law could destroy her daughter's life forever. Moreover, Alexis fears that Sonny, who is constantly targeted by enemies and law enforcement, will be dragged into the investigation if the truth is revealed. As an experienced attorney, Alexis is fully aware of the risks that Christina and Sonny will face if they are suspected or charged. Therefore, Alexis has chosen to take the blame for Christina, despite knowing that this will put her in a very dangerous position. By confessing to the crime, Alexis has mentally prepared herself to face severe legal consequences. She knows that this decision could lead to her being sentenced, losing her freedom, and possibly never seeing her family again. But in Alexis's mind, this sacrifice is worth it if it means protecting Christina from imprisonment and keeping Sonny out of the dark spiral of malicious plots. Alexis's decision also forces her to grapple with intense inner conflict. She is taking on a guilt that she did not cause, but her love for her daughter and her desire to protect her family have led her to choose this path. She is also aware that, once she confesses, there is no turning back, and she will have to live with this decision for the rest of her life. Those around Alexis may not understand why she is doing this, and it could lead to significant conflicts within the family and among friends. However, Alexis believes that taking the blame is the only way to keep Christina and Sonny safe, and she is willing to pay the price for it. In this decisive moment, Alexis demonstrates her courage and intense love for her family, even knowing that she will have to face serious consequences for her actions. Sonny and Jason have decided to dispose of John's body, a risky but necessary action under the current circumstances. Both understand that concealing John's death is crucial to protect themselves and their family from potential legal repercussions. Jason, with his experience and cold demeanor, quickly devised a plan with Sonny to deal with the body without leaving any trace that could lead back to them. Although Sonny has decided to hide the truth, he is formulating a bigger plan in his mind. He knows that simply disposing of the body won't be enough to erase all suspicion. Therefore, Sonny is devising a comprehensive strategy to ensure that the story of John's death will never be uncovered. This might involve creating false evidence or even fabricating an entirely different scenario to mislead the police and anyone who might investigate further. Sonny also understands that keeping this secret requires tight coordination and absolute silence from everyone involved. He not only has to face law enforcement scrutiny, but also those enemies who are always waiting for a chance to bring him down. Thus, Sonny's plan is not just about covering up a crime, but also ensuring that no one can discover the truth. 
even under the most thorough investigation. While Jason handles the disposal, Sonny has begun taking steps to control the narrative his way. He might use his connections and influence in the city to steer the investigation, making it difficult for anyone pursuing the case to find the truth. At the same time, Sonny isn't ruling out the possibility of using violence or threats to ensure that John's death remains buried forever. However, no matter how perfect the plan may seem, Sonny and Jason know they are walking a tightrope between life and death. Freedom and imprisonment, any mistake could cost them dearly. But with determination and loyalty to his family, Sonny is willing to do whatever it takes to ensure that the truth about John's death never sees the light of day. Thank you.